Oh, at last, at last, I've done it. My lifelong dream, a moving house. It's made of a special light, yet sturdy wood, and fire poses no threat at all. It's absolutely, completely fireproof. Go on and try it. The four of you, step outside and push the house. It'll move. There's one problem, though. Fill the house with furniture, and it becomes too heavy to budge. That's why I've had to leave it entirely empty. It's a bit stark, but I like it. We can push the house? Why do we need to push the house? Alright, alright. So I guess we have to push it out of the way for some crazy reason. Um, and wow, I'm taking a lot of damage. Can I kill these guys somehow? Wow, these are really annoying. Um, let's see. I'm probably gonna have to wait for them. There we go. And let's push the house. Oh! And pushing the house kills the enemies. Okay. Um, so that's good. That's, that's good to know. Did, no, don't know what to really do with it. Um, maybe I'm supposed to kill all the enemies in this area with the house. So let's see if we can actually do that. Um, it seems like even when it gets near this little area, we can um, pretty much kill all these enemies. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and just move it. I wonder if we can pull it. Um, if we can pull it too, that would be pretty awesome. Um, we're about to figure that out, I guess. Um, we should be able to. Cool, cool, cool. Um, that's good stuff. And the house is just going a little bit crazy now. I'm going to go ahead and go back to the left end then. And then push it. Let's see if we can... No, that, that's not far enough. Push it like this. And then let's push it to the right. We have to do something with this. Um, I don't know what. I'm, I'm, my guess is really killing off all these guys. So I'm, I'm, once we're done killing off all these guys, hopefully um, we'll be headed where we need to go. Um, so I guess we'll see. Let me go ahead and push it down because there's one more guy stuck down there. We killed him off, and I'm going to go ahead and pull the house. And there's one more little guy chilling over there. Um, I'm, I'm guessing something's going to appear uh, once we're done pulling it. But well, if not, then wow, that was a waste of time. Um, let's see. Come here. Come here, little guy. Little guy's stuck up there. All right, watch out. He's not so little anymore, trying to trying to bully me and stuff. Let me go ahead and get the formation. Let's. Why can't I push it? Why can't I push it from that end? Um, fantastic. Oh, wow. I guess one person can pull it. And there we go. Um, let me pull a little bit further up. And then I'm going to go ahead and push it from the side once I get all the guys here. Um, yeah, let's get everybody here. And let's start pushing it. And hopefully that'll kill off the final thing and then see what else it leads us to from here. All right, come on. Little guy needs to come down a little bit. The little rock soldier dude needs to come down like a tiny bit so we can actually kill him off. Why isn't he? Why isn't he coming up? Why am I not doing anything? Kill him! Kill him, minions! Kill him, Lynx! Okay, there we go. I heard a doo -doo 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 -doo, but I have no idea what it was for. Um. Oh wow! Look, we got a hammer or something like a like an item. So sweet! You got a magic hammer. This mighty mallet makes anyone a powerhouse. Press the A button. So I guess we have a hammer now. I'm guessing we can kill these guys. At last, we can kill these little derpy looking fellows um, with our hammers, which is cool. Cool with me, um, by all means, and I don't really want to use any more force fairies um, than we already have had to. Um, what else can this hammer do? Um, I'm guessing there's something else that... Uh, ah, force fairies. Okay, okay. Um, this is only our second force fairy today. But as we go on, we're probably going to have to use more. So, you know, not much we can do, but suck it up and continue on in our adventure. Let me go ahead and kill off this guy. And now we're going to head back down. And I don't think we've been in this cave before. I'm pretty sure we haven't been in here before. Um, and there seems to be switches. So I guess that's what this mallet does. Um, it allows you to crunch switches, which is okay with me. Um, let me go ahead and crunch these two then. Maybe there's something magical. Oh, we got a force fairy. So cool. We got a force fairy. I'm going to go ahead and slam the rest of these. Um, no, I guess it didn't do anything. But we did get a force fairy, at, which is cool with me. And uh, we're going to have to figure out where else exactly it is we need to go um, with this hammer. Can we... Oh, look. Look. We can knock down those pegs with it, um, which is cool with me. Dark Link's over here chilling. Let me go ahead and rush him. He, it looks like he's going to do something sketchy. I'm going to climb up here, and he's got bombs on him. Um, guess nothing we can do there with him right now. Let's continue up here. There's a weird guy. What is this thing? Can we hurt it with our hammer? Player 1 took great damage. I'm guessing this is like a mini boss um, type thing. Let me go ahead and just try and uh, get in a formation and see if I can damage this guy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We easy with the rocks, dude. Holy crap. All right, this guy's a little bit tougher than I expected him to be. Um, and we killed him. Okay, cool. Thank goodness we killed him before he killed us because I'm, I'm getting close to having to use another force fairy. I know. It's kind of ridiculous. Uh, I'm already on like my fourth force fairy. Or my third, my third. Okay, so here we go. Whoa, we got three of these guys this time. Um, I should probably head inside this cave and check it before we continue on. There's bombs here. Uh, maybe bombs will allow me to hurt these guys a little more. Um, okay, okay, okay. So I guess using the bombs um, will allow me to hurt them without taking damage. Um, wait, wait, wait. Where am I? Where am I? Put me back in this. Put me back in this. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and, and get a force gem. No, not get hit. I'm going to go ahead and get a bomb. Once it respawns, respawn bomb, respawn. I'm gonna get the bomb, 
And then I'm gonna go stand right here. And then let's rush in there. Let's chuck it at him. And that damages them, but not fully. You know what? We're gonna have to take the Force Fairy and we're gonna have to kill him off. I cannot believe we've already used three Force Fairies. That's absolutely ridiculous. Whew, that that is insanity right there. Three Force Fairies already. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and recharge that and see if we can just hurt the crap out of them. Um, because these guys are tough. I wish we had a couple more heart containers on us, but uh, we, we can't seem to have any right now. Um, Alright, there we go. We got a couple heart uh, pieces, or hearts at least. And these guys give us really good amounts of gems, which is cool with me. Um, the more gems, the merrier, because they're gonna help us finish the level off. We're coming up close to the 2,000 point. Oh, you have got to be kidding me. You have got to be kidding me. A hundred of them? Alright, let's talk to this witch. Such youth troubled by giants are you. We magic users have a chain of two types of medallion. These medallions instantly alter the shape of an evil presence or make it vanish. One of these medallions is in that treasure chest there. It's one that I enchanted myself. You may use it if you like. Alright, so here we go. We got the medallion. Okay, so these quake medallions are what um, helped us last time uh, to, to kill everything. So hopefully we can use it here. Let's throw it and hopefully that'll kill off all these giants. And give us a crap load of force gems while we're at it. And then turn them into uh, jelly things. Alright, this is going to be a lot more easy to kill them. Alright, so let's go ahead and kill these, these little jellies. Which are going to be nothing compared to those gigantic giant things um, that we had to go up against. Thanks to that witch's magic. Uh, we were able to defeat them. Alright, here we go. Um, we should be coming up to the top of uh, Death Mountain soon would be my guess. But I'm not sure. Let's read the sign. Hebra's Hill. And there's like a little little teleporter thing here. Um, and we have entered Hebra's Hill. I'm just going to continue up through Hebra's Hill. Wait, this is a maze, isn't it? Yeah, because I think we just climbed up the same thing like twice. Um, okay, must be a little maze then. Something, Something's going on here. But they always have these. It's, it's like the little lost wood things. All right, um, two eyes. What does that mean? Uh, maybe I need to go in between the eyes. I'm going to go ahead up here. Um, I, I honestly have no idea what I'm doing. Let's see what. It, let's see if I kill that. That's just nothing. Um, two eyeballs. Maybe I should head down. I haven't really headed down yet. No. All right. I guess Hebrews Hill is a maze, and I'm gonna have to figure out how to go. What? 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 All right. Um, maybe I can go through here one by one, and um, figure out where exactly it is I need to go. Um, if I leave these little guys with me, um, this is this is weird. I'm like I'm like trying to figure out where you need to go. Um, I don't know. This is kind of strange. Let's go to the left. I just keep appearing in the same exact place. Um, I, I have no idea how to get through this. If I can't figure this out, um, I'm gonna be back in like a couple seconds when I figure out how to get through this maze. Alright, I made my way through by just running through there as you guys were just able to see. Um, and now we're back here and it seems like we have a mini boss fight or maybe even the boss fight. Um, it's just a bunch of these guys. These are pretty simple. Um, if you just get behind them like you guys, oh wow, we're getting rushed. We are getting attacked. We are in uh, a hurry now. Um, let's kill off all these guys and do the magical spinny thingy we always do. I think we're, we're actually going to be supercharged here in like in like a couple hits. Um, if I can get over there, we're going to be good. And there we go. We have the power of the the go go power rangers or our filter sword filled sword yes that that the power to repel evil um and let's go ahead and kill go ahead and kill off all these guys then um now so we can continue on all right come here come here come here little guys come here little buddies um and wait what why is he stuck behind that wall come on um I'm just, I just kind of want to rush this guy and just take him out. That was an enormous damage, dude. Those giants were a bigger, bigger fight than this. I should have just attacked those giants. I should have tried to fight them by myself. That would have been awesome. Um, all right, watch out, watch out. Let's kill off this last guy. We, if we could do this properly. And I think we're about to kill the big guy, big the big guy, before we can um finish off this guy. Wow, I cannot talk today. I am having difficulty speaking. And this is a crap load of force gems. Um, my goodness, I don't even need all these, but. I guess they're going to help us because they give us force fairies. And as you guys were able to tell, um, I pretty much need those a lot more now. Um, because I have, haven't been able to uh, defeat enemies as often. Alright, there's, there's a cave here. 
Um, no, oh, never mind, never mind. That's just where the enemies came out of. And it seems like we have officially made it um, to close to the top of Death Mountain, if not to the top. Um, and I'm going to go ahead and pick up what? One, give me the Force Gems. Um, a crap load of Force Gems before we continue on. Uh, Force Fairies 14, and now all we have to do is enter the portal. Once I get this green one, fantastic. And let's go ahead and make our way through and head back to the title main menu screen because we have officially defeated the first level to Death Mountain. Okay, so next up, it looks like it's going to be the mountain path, the second level of Death Mountain. We're going to continue on, you know, with this blind LP where I don't know where I'm going. I honestly have no idea where I'm going half this time. So thank you guys so much for watching. In the next episode, we'll continue on to the mountain path. Um, until then, catch you guys later. Bye.